But like at the same time, I didn't change anything. I just thought change would come. I just thought, oh, okay, this is just a fat phase you're going through. You have to do something about it. It's not just dieting. You can't just go, well, I'm going to go on a little diet. I went in and out of diets, stupid little diets, or I would just not really eat for most of the day and then eat everything at night. Like, I was so stupid about it. I killed my metabolism. So then I used that as an excuse for most of my life. Oh, I don't have a metabolism. I can't lose weight. Which I really convinced my... Like, they're all excuses. And the more excuses you make, if you just didn't do any of those excuses and you would have started when you th first thought about it, it would have been done already. If you would have went running when you were like, I should go running, you would already be back by the time. You know what I'm saying? You don't? Me neither. But, you know, they say calories are calories. They're not. Eating um, 500 calories of deep fried mini corn dogs is a lot different than eating 500 calories worth of fruits and vegetables. Those are good calories. Those are going to help you. Those are nutritious. Those are valuable. Deep fried mini corn dogs? Eh. And oh god, I used to love corn dogs. I remember when I was a kid, my favorite food I said was corn dogs and French bread with cream cheese and strawberries. Actually, a French baguette. Not French bread. There's a difference. I don't know what you guys want to hear, but I'm going to itch my armpit. I just read something about deodorant can cause breast cancer. Guess it's a good thing I don't wear deodorant. <laughs> hmm. Probably should. You know it's bad when your grandma suggests that you go on Weight Watchers. And I'm pr grandma pants. Grandma pants suggested that I went on Weight Watchers. I didn't. I just did it on my own. Slowly but surely. The weight didn't just fall off. I mean... Of naturally, you have to take baby steps. The baby steps will eventually lead to skipping and frolicking. They will. You'll be frolicking among the unicorns. I just want to inspire and help people. That's what I want to do. I've been getting so many messages, and when I say so many, I mean like two, and I've responded to both. I just want you guys to see that you can do it. I mean, I did it. Any... It sucks. I know it sucks. You feel stuck. You feel like nothing's ever going to change. You're always going to be that way. But it doesn't have to be like that. I promise you. You just have to make goals and you have to stick to them. You have to say, you know what? I'm not going to eat after 8.30. I'm not going to do it. Because I would be eating until the sun rose. I would just be on the internet. My keyboard was orange from Flamin' Hot Cheetos. I was lethargic. I didn't want to leave the house. All I thought about was what I was going to eat, which was everything. I need guidance. We need to guide each other. I need to know what you want to hear, because I don't want to preach. I don't want to sound condescending. I don't want to be like, oh yes, I'm a fitness trainer. I'm a nutritionist. I can, but I know I can help you. I want to help you. I want to help everyone. I want to inspire you. I want to motivate you to change your lives for the better. Like, this is the year. This is the last year of our lives, guys. Actually, if this was the last year of my life, if, if this, I'd eat everything. Everything. Because what's the point, really? Uh. Just walking. Start by walking. And then Go into power walk mode, then go into freaking punch mode. Yeah, I'm that person sometimes where I'm punching while I'm walking. But I don't want this to be all about, like, health and fitness. And I know more than that, you know? I've been through a lot. I've been through a lot, and I feel like I can relate to a lot of people. I mean, I'm, I'm still that girl on YouTube, but... I was that girl on YouTube, the biggest fangirl. I still am. That's why I'm here, is because I was a fangirl. That's what, I was Lisa Nova's biggest fan. I was persistent. I was fat, <laughs> too. And this was after I had lost some weight. Thankfully, she still accepted me. Maybe we should go to the store together. Would you guys like that? Because there's so many staple food, pro food products that I think everyone should be eating, like Greek yogurt or high in protein, probiotics, you know how I feel about the poopty poopty. That's a whole nother thing. There's so many things. 
I don't even think, did I even tell you guys my journey or story? I don't think I did. I don't know. Well, I do know I'll always be a fat kid at heart. I saw that McDonald's is going to be releasing an Oreo pie. Oh my jizz. You can healthify anything though, guys. There's healthier Oreos out there. There really is. And they're just as delicious. Almost. Healthy can be delicious. They can be synonymous. They don't have to be enemies. You can make them into babies. If I can do it, you can do it. Believe me. I'm not a superhero. I'm just your ordinary girl trying to get by. Just stay, just another day. Trying. Quit making excuses. Quit putting it off. And if you're going to start eating healthy, okay, so you already, today, maybe you already had three donuts this morning. You're like, oh, but I already had three donuts. I might as well just like eat shitty for the rest of the day. You're going to do that forever. I think that's one of the, another way that we continuously gain weight is because we keep putting it off and be like, oh, well, then I should just eat whatever I want today. No, you can change and start right now. Like, go eat a salad then. But don't, not iceberg lettuce, that also doesn't really have any nutritional value. Go for spinach, or collards, or kale. Kale is a nutritional powerhouse. Kale, kale, ass, ass, kale, kale. I don't know what... Whoa! Jizzalicious! You should be taking vitamins, multivitamins. The gummy ones are delicious. That's a whole nother video, guys. I don't understand why they make vitamins, gummy vitamins, so much better than actual gummies. It just doesn't make sense. Do you want me to OD on vitamin gummies? Because I will. I will do that. Literally, my bra was like a hammock. Like, I could sleep in that thing. If my plane was going down, I could just take out my bra and parachute. Woo! They weren't even like attractive boobies were like mm, look at them boobies they were like oh my god what are those things it's all like mushy it's set and droop what mm, i make a damn good omelet i really do sorry i don't know what i just did with my life and your life i apologize but believe in yourself because i believe in you i really 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 do